hi everyone welcome back today I have what's in my bag video to share with you guys and it is um, my Chanel executive silk tote and this is in the silver hardware this video uh, was requested by one of my YouTube subscriber her channel name is Miss Frazier one so go check her out I will list her channel name down below in the description box and uh, she does have a, a YouTube channel and she's got some lovely handbags and you know just some um, beautiful handbag collection all right let's begin so this bag does come with the longer strap like that and I just keep the strap on just because someday I feel like I need a little bit of help um, when my arm get a little tired from carrying it I would throw the uh, strap over my shoulder and it does um, help a lot so let's begin the um, front of the bag looks like this and um, the turn lock closure right here I don't normally use this area this uh, pocket and uh, let's show you what's inside the bag this is what I have in the bag right now I know it's kind of messy but um, it is what's in my bag so I'm just gonna you know pull out things to share with you what uh, I carry from day to day first thing is a pair of gloves I do live in Canada and it does get you know quite chilly at times so you just never know when you might need the uh, the gloves on next item um, is the L zip wallet and this is in the gold hardware have that there um, my Chanel sunglasses and this is the polarized lens and uh, it does have the pearl detailing on the side there and the CC logo right there it's a lovely sunglasses and um, I could probably just carry it in this pouch alone However, um, I'm kind of scared that I might get it all um, squashed inside the bag. So I just put the, the sunglasses in the case. I know it's quite heavy. Chanel makes such a bulky case. And, you know, it's so hard to close even with the uh, pouch that came with it. Next item is my Tiffany prescription glasses. And um, I'm due for another glasses soon. So this is what it looks like. I'll show you guys. It's such a um, nice detailing of the flowers with the crystal in the center. So, so cute. Get many compliments when I do wear that um, glasses. Next thing is the Chanel card holder. And this is in the Ruthenium hardware. And I have a whole bunch of cards and receipts in there. I love this piece. I also have the mini mini pochette. And this is where I just normally keep my... Um, this Altoids container is actually full of Advils. So, you know, just in case I get a headache, I have the Advil with me. I do have like a whole whack of lipstick which I'm not going to show you I have a bite beauty um, mirror which I don't want to blind you but it's a mirror on the other side and then you know just the little hair clip and a whole bunch of lipstick and whatnot I do have a receipt in there which I should take out and yeah so this piece comes in handy just uh, and put everything back in there it's a lovely piece to have and I also have a kind of like a catch-all um, makeup bag the toiletry 19 I have my uh, reading glasses in here it's super cute I'll show you what's in the uh, what it looks like inside and uh, as you can see it's just a, a reading glasses just in case I, you know, just want to see something up uh, close. It's so hard to see right now. My eyesight is getting so bad. All right. And this bag here in the Ziploc bag, uh, this is where I keep my emergency 
vitamin C powder. I can just, you know, uh, put these in the bottle of water, shake it up, and then give myself a little extra boost of vitamin C. I also have some Japanese green tea. I have um, a few candies in there. This is the coffee candy. So, you know, just on the day where I'm feeling a little low, I need some sugar fix. I just pop one of these candy in my mouth and I'm good to, uh, to go until I get something to eat. I have a hand lotion by OPI. I have another lipstick in here by Kat Von D. I have also hand cream. Um, I like to carry a lotion and a hand cream together. Just, you know, sometimes I feel like I need um, to have a different um, option. All right, sorry about that. All right, let's see here. Um, that's it for inside the bag. There's nothing else in here. On the uh, pocket in the back, the zipper pocket, I have two more candies in there. Let's close that up. And in the front, there's another zipper compartment in here, which I don't put anything in here except for my um, authenticity card. All right, in the back pocket right here, the slip, not the slip, but just the uh, uh, the back pocket, it's just uh, my phone, which is the iPhone 6S Plus with the um, the uh, the case from Louis Vuitton. If you want me to do um, a review on this phone case, let me know. I received this on my birthday in December so I didn't get a, a chance to do the unboxing on this piece but I can do a, a review and see um, you know what the pros and cons are with that uh, phone case I also in the back pocket keep my um, key clay my car key and some change in there so let's put that back in here and that's just basically it I do not put the um, Sorry, I do not put the um, removable pouch that came with the bag right here inside the bag just because when I do put things in here it does get a little heavy if I put too much things in here it gets so heavy that uh, the snap closure on the side will come undone which is kind of a a pain you know it's annoying but it does look nice if you have it in here but I have so much things in there already that I feel like I do not need to put this in the bag inside the bag so let's put everything back in here so you can see one more time how much I can fit in here and also I will show you as well that it will probably fit a 13 inch MacBook in if you don't have this much stuff in like I do right now and um, it will probably fit the MacBook for sure inside the bag if you know you take out a few things but um, for sure my iPad mini iPad does fit and I can probably just slot that in the front pocket right there. All right. So that's that. If you guys um, can only see this bag in person, I mean, it is quite roomy. I can probably fit more things in here, but um, you know, I already have it pretty filled up and for what I need on a daily basis I mean this is quite a lot I could probably you know downsize some of the um, the lipstick in that little mini pochette I could you know take out a lot more stuff from this bag if I wanted to um, but other than that you know it's not bad it is heavy not that heavy that you couldn't carry it around um, 
bear in mind I do have the um, the iPad the mini iPad in here and you know if I'm just running errands I'm not going to be needing the iPad so that can come out and I'll probably you know take out my sunglasses and just have that in my car instead and you know there'll be less things in here to carry but uh, that's that and uh, this shoulder strap comes in very handy just you know when it gets a little bit too much you can just throw it over your shoulder and uh, give yourself a rest on your arm and I think I covered everything for this bag I hope that helps you Miss Frazier one and uh, if you decided to uh, purchase this bag I don't think you could go wrong um, seriously I looked at this bag the same time I purchased my Chanel GST and uh, it was the two that I was kind of like torn between I ended up coming home with the GST because that was my dream bag to uh, to have and um, I always knew that one day I would purchase the uh, executive tote and I'm so happy I got it I would have loved it to be the gold hardware but I'm happy um, at the moment just because it is silver hardware I have the Chanel GST in the gold hardware so that's kind of like um, you know um, change things up a bit all right and uh, I will upload this video either today or sometime this week and uh, thank you so much for watching any questions or comments just leave them down below I will do my best to answer them for you and um, have a great night bye for now